Hey, what's up everyone and welcome to my release day unboxing for Lost Planet 3 on Xbox 360. And this of course is the sequel to Lost Planet 2. It's also the second sequel in the Lost Planet series, if you couldn't tell by the 3 at the end of the title. Uh, it also has snow, there's some guns, there most likely are guns, there's some mechs, and bugs that you shoot, and most likely when you shoot them, Green blood will fly out. Maybe sometimes blue. Maybe even like a, a lightish green. Who knows? Maybe dark green. Uh, I, I don't remember. But uh, maybe they, maybe they shoot out purple blood. I don't know. Uh, but <laughs> I don't remember. But Lost Planet 1, I really enjoyed. I really did like that game. Uh, actually, I would even say I loved it. Uh, it had a great, great atmosphere. Uh, the graphics were beautiful. The gunplay was a lot of fun. And all of the other stuff was, you know, good. Um, I did not like Lost Planet 2. Lost Planet 2 started off pretty decent and then it just went to repetitive and frustrating and when it wasn't frustrating it was boring so I didn't really care for that game uh, actually I would say I hate that game but Lost Planet 3 looked like it could be a lot of fun it could be very interesting story-wise which I would say Lost Planet 1 and 2 definitely did not have that this I heard actually has a pretty good story with a really likable main character um, I'm looking forward to playing this. I got this game pretty much for free. My GameStop, I traded in two old games that I wasn't going to play anymore, and I pretty much got this for free. Uh, so, cool. Um, alright, so Lost Planet 3, let's, uh, unbox it. So, for all the people that are like, oh, you got a lot of money and stuff, well, I have to trade in a lot of stuff sometimes to get these games. Um, and, sadly, I wanted to at least rent this game, but, uh, Gamefly's shitty, so, <laughs> they don't send me games anymore. But, well, I'll, I'll admit, Gamefly did send me uh, XCOM The Bureau, so... I'm sorry, The Bureau, XCOM Declassified. I keep screwing up that title. Um, they did send me that, so that's cool. Uh, and I don't know about a review for that. I still haven't played too much of Splinter Cell, so... <laughs> don't expect a review for XCOM. Uh, especially since I've been really busy with school stuff. Oh, really? Look at this. Box is broken already. Alright. Oh, wow. They fucked this box up. Are you kidding me? Wow, look at this. Jesus Christ, GameStop. Power to the players. I know I didn't do that. There's no way I did it. Wow. Alright, so let's open this. Alright, it comes with absolutely nothing. The disc. And that's it. Oh, actually, I forgot to show the front and the back. Uh, there's the front. You got the dude. Uh, he looks like Nicolas Cage, as I've been told by many people. Uh, uh, yeah. yeah. Uh, he kind of does. Uh, he actually kind of sounds like him, too. And at times, uh, from what I saw in the gameplay. Oh, that really pisses me off, man. They fucking, they don't treat the boxes right. Oh my god, look at this. Gee, thanks. Thanks, GameStop. Fucking retards. Uh, uh, survival is not enough, it says around the back. Survival is not enough. Oh, and by the way, this is the same GameStop I got my Deadpool copy from. If you didn't see my unboxing of that, go check it out. Uh, you'll see why. Uh, I don't like this GameStop, but uh, it, it was the only one that had both this and the other game I got today. But anyway, survival is not enough. As a new arrival to the forebo uh, foreboding alien planet of EDN3, you must fight for your family, your colony, and your dignity. <laughs> as, the, as the fate of all humanity hangs in the balance, go beyond survival. Intense cinematic experience, return to extreme conditions you know, cold, uh, 10 person online multiplayer, not 12, 10, uh, not 16, 10, uh, visceral shooter gameplay off foot and, me and mechanized mayhem in the utility rig, there you go, and here's the side if you want to see that, and like I said, there's nothing in it, except a, a, a bunch of broken chips of the box, because they don't know how to handle their shit, obviously, you know, just... I didn't pay for it, but I did give up a couple of pretty good games to get this. So, thanks GameStop, power to players. Um, so, there you go, there's my unboxing, and there's my deboxing, because obviously it's ripping apart. Uh, so, there you go, Lost Planet 3. I'm looking forward to playing it. Look forward to what Gore plays on my other account, Gore the Movie Got 3. Uh, I have an XCOM Bureau declassified uh, uh, Gore plays up there, most likely right now. If I don't, I will later on today. So there you go. There's a uh, Lost Planet. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you and goodbye.